the warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. And here we have PSV against Barcelona. I'm Peter Drury, and it's my chance to say that it is an absolute delight to have Jim Beglin beside me. Well, I can tell you, I'm truly delighted to join you, Peter, and, and thank you very much for that. then what do you think this turns on Jim well, I would go for the supremely athletic Jordi Alba yet another of the modern fullbacks that is blessed with great stamina and pace which allow really effective late runs forward and help with his recovery and getting back <laughs> I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a defender once upon a time Jim managed to get it away Keeper and go again. Maya. Jordi Alba cuts it out. Looks to slip it through. Gets into some space. It's well blocked and back out it comes. Good strike, quite an alarm. Messi. So it is still nil-nil. Rakitic, Barcelona get it back again, Iniesta, Rakitic, Jordi Alba looking up to see who wants it, good determined running there but run back by the defence, has got good distance on that Luis Suarez now it's Iniesta truthfully it was hard to see any better outcome there he's on the move and he's going to have to go in alone well positioned to make that interception now the ball's come loose and the chase is on great run this he's covered quite a distance lovely feet to safety struck first time that really should have hit the net that was a very decent shot from distance you know, a little less strength and it might have just dipped under the bar good effort though Rakitic tries a through ball corner it is Jordi Alba gets good distance on it. Well, there wasn't much of an appetite to close him down from that range then. And it's going to be the final action of the first half. So we reach the halfway point. Well, that half-time dressing room now should be full of encouragement from the way they finished the first 45 minutes. They must restart with the same level of intensity, though. Any drop, and they're going to let this opposition off the hook. They really have to make it count now. And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. That gets things going for the second half. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. Messi with the ball through. It's Luis Suarez! Flags up. <laughs> Looks like a good 
good ball through. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Pass towards the front, Up towards the hour mark, and still no goals. Now the pass. What an adventurous run from a defender. Against the crossbar, can he put it away? Big relief, it just needed better contact. Well, that was worth the effort, I mean, it was a long way out, but he caught it so well. Poorly directed kick from the keeper, he's given it away. It's got through. He's had a go! It's in! Just to pick me up, the whole game needs! What about that, Jim Beglin? It's really a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. PSV take the lead. Yeah, and they still have enough time to carve out a chance or two and get right back into this. Passes it through. Up he gets! Oh, just needed a better contact. Oh, they really wanted that. There's so many players in the box. Everyone's committed to attack now. Oh, that's great stuff. Exactly what he's all about. I think what we're looking at here is just a very special talent. Someone who can decide the outcome of a match on his own. Mascherano. PSV had to make a change here. PK. So they got the only goal to give them a 1-0 lead. Messi will not want to lose out here, not against this opponent. Maia. Made certain that won't get through. Now it's Luis Suarez. 1 0 as we head towards the end. Now it's Luis Suarez. Now it's Messi. PSV just have to run down the clock. it through it's official showing that there will be three minutes of added time has a swing at it back of the net and with that goal comes comfort a pretty simple finish in the end what do you think Jim well, I just think there was too much ball watching uh, nobody's really looking to see who's drifting into good striking positions and it's a bad one to give away, it really is. up and very little time left surely this is it another piece of really good defending he 
Hammond in towards the centre. They are running riot! And the lead is three! It is surely done! Well, that always looked the likely outcome. Yeah, I've got great admiration for the finish, but I've even more admiration for the pass that set it up. It was delicious. PSV take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. The final whistle. PSV have won big and in style. Everything went for them. Their poor opponents left chasing shadows. A scintillating performance. Well, what are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? At times it was like Groundhog Day because of their continuous success in using Witten as the best route to goal. It worked a treat, and it, it looked a treat. Another point I can make is that the foundations for this win were placed near both touchlines because they were able to build attack after attack with little resistance. Thanks to Jim, we both wish you a very good evening.